To other stories, plans are underway to reopen the Mina Airport once ongoing renovation works are completed. The Niger State Governor Marubago said this while on inspection of the ongoing work. The airport, which was closed in 2019, has made air travel difficult for residents who have to travel to Abuja or Kano to catch a flight. Chenemi Bameyi reports, and after this report, we will bring you updates in business and sports. Stay with us. March 2017, when the Inamdi Azikiwe International Airport Abuja closed for renovations, Abuja-bound flights were redirected to Kaduna rather than the Mina Airport, which is about three hours' drive from Abuja. The then Minister of Aviation, Hadi Sirika, said the airport facilities, runways and instrument landing systems could not be compared to that of the Kaduna Airport. As a result, some renovation works began in 2017 in the airport and in 2019, the airport was shut down from commercial activities and has not been opened ever since. This has made travel difficult, especially for passengers who have to travel to Abuja or Kano to catch a flight to their next destination. For journeys or flight that you will have taken straight from you know, to where you are going, you have to either go to Abuja or Kano or Lagos. And at times the anxiety, the fear of losing your flight because of the time you have to travel, you know, so it has really affected us. Again, it does not really sound where it's not really good. And this is a power state, and Niger State is a very large state. At many states that are not up to Niger State, they have their own airports. So I please, uh, we are pleading with the governor of Niger State to do something fast about it, to really impart on us. There are two former heads of state resident in Niger State and Governor Umar Bago, while inspecting the renovation activities in the MENA airport, expressed worry that without a functional airport, road traveling for these former heads of state might be too strenuous considering their age. And, uh, the economy of the state is affected and uh, a lot of uh, people are suffering, especially those programs that went for Hajj, you know, they couldn't uh, leave them from here. We're hopeful that uh, before the end of uh, August, some of them will land here. And you know, we have elder statesmen in the state, two former presidents who are aged. Uh, this airport uh, serves them a lot, so we cannot afford to put them on the road every time. And uh, that's why the state has come in. If there is need for the state to intervene, you know, we would also uh, put resources to make sure that it's completed. The MENA airport has been serving the annual airlifting of pilgrims to Saudi Arabia for annual pilgrimage for over 10 years. The renovation work on both the arrival and departure wings of the airport, which was initially built to serve as alternative ports to the Abuja airport, was stopped by the previous administration due to lack of funds. Chenemibami, TVC News, MENA.